Siemens busway systems are a safe and efficient way to power industrial, commercial, and institutional environments. This video is a step-by-step -step guide to horizontal and vertical busway support installation. Throughout the installation, make sure you use the Centron installation and maintenance instructions for reference, beginning with section 7.0. Trapeze hangers and single drop rod hangers are used to support horizontal busway, as long as the spacing between the hangers is 10 feet or less. The required half-inch steel drop rods and hardware is furnished by the installer. If possible, avoid hangers at busway joints and plug-in openings. It's also important to maintain good alignment along the busway run. Sway brackets can help straighten the alignment and prevent the busway from swaying or rotating. For a trapeze hanger install, center the busway on the trapeze hanger. Then, install a hanger clamp on each side of the busway with the hardware provided. Be sure the hanger clamp tabs are in the tab slots. The wall hanger attaches to the busway, just as the trapeze hanger did. The installation of the hanger on the wall is the responsibility of the installer. Wall hangers ensure adequate spacing between the wall and the busway. Next, we'll cover how to install vertical support. Spring hangers are used to support vertical or riser busway with spacing between spring hangers 16 feet or less. For this type of install, a joint cannot be within 16 inches of the floor. This ensures all joints are exposed for maintenance purposes. After the busway section is installed through the floor, firmly press one spring hanger into each side channel until it snaps into place. Then, slide the hangers down until the support bolt heads rest on the steel support brackets supplied by the installer. These brackets must be mounted to the floor and can be installed over a floor flange. Hold the hanger firmly against the side channel and tighten the self-piercing screws with a half-inch wrench until the screws pierce the side channel flanges and the heads are pressed tight on the hanger. Now that we've completed the entire busway and spring hanger install, Loosen and move all jam nuts to the top of the support bolts with a three-quarter inch wrench. It is critical to start at the highest spring hanger in the run. Raise the leveling nuts until they touch the jam nuts and then tighten the two nuts against each other. It's important to periodically inspect the installation to be sure the bolt heads rest against the floor brackets. If you notice fully compressed springs, bolt heads that don't touch floor brackets, or any distortion of the run, adjustment may be required. We hope this information has been beneficial. If you have questions or need further assistance at any time while using Siemens Busway Systems, please refer to the Storage, Installation, and Maintenance Instructions or visit usa.siemens.com.